Hello friends, subscribe technology and press the bell icon to never miss the updates. Hey what's up guys welcome back to our channel technology and today in this video I'm going to show you guys how to backup and restore all your drivers in your Windows 10 or Windows 7 PC so you just need to follow me so first of all you need to download this software it's called double driver so uh, I will give you the link to my video description it's only 2.1 MB the size is 2.1 MB and after download you will get this uh, zip file so you have to extract on your computer just I'm going to extract here so here's a folder so after open the folder you have to right click on dd.exe and after that click on run as administrator after that click on yes now you will get this window so if you want to back up your all all your drivers then you have to click over there on this backup option and after that click on scan current system and you can see all my drivers over there so if you want to back up then you have to select all the drivers so you can select if you want to select all the drivers then you have to click on this all or if you want to select the non Microsoft then you can click on over there so I will show you guys how to back up so just select any driver from there and click on backup now so now you have to select your folder where you need to save your backup so click over there and after that select your folder so I will select uh, under D drive double driver so here so currently there was no backup as you can see so if I'll click OK so as you can see it's showing the operation completed successfully and automatically one folder is created over there as you can see here's a backup folder so if you want to restore uh, your backup then click on restore over there and after that it's showing over there as you can see so click on locate your backup and click on other location and after that you have to select this folder so go to that same location and select that folder and click on OK it will show your all the all the backups and after that you have to select your backup and click on restore now so I will not do that right now so I hope this small video will really help for you and please don't forget to click on the subscribe button like button and share button and if you have any queries or questions in the comments down below I will see you guys in the next for next video take care